Okay, figuring out how to enable the administrator account that is somewhere mystically hidden within the computer that always frustrates you, here's the way to do it. Now, first things first, you cannot miss this step. Now, first, you're going to go to the search bar, the Cortana bar, however you want to look at it. Simply type in CMD. That's going to bring up the command prompt. Do not left click this. This is the single most important part of this. You need to right click on this and run as administrator. If you do not run as administrator, this will not work. So all you have to do is simply type in net user administrator and then forward slash active colon yes and you will get the command completed successfully now i do recommend that if you are going to have this on there that you put a password on here if you don't put a password on here anybody basically that accesses your computer has administrator rights and that's where things can get a little bit fishy to add a password simply type in net user administrator space asterisk which is your shift eight and then it's going to ask you to type in a password for the user. And that's when you can type in the password for said user. So there's a very simple and easy way of doing this to add a password. Now, if we do the exact same thing over again, and let's say that we don't want somebody to have access or we want to disable that momentarily, it's simply almost the exact same command as it's net administrator forward slash active colon. And instead of yes, this time it's going to be no. Now, there you have it, and all of a sudden, that account is now inactive. And that's a very simple and easy way of accessing the administrator account. Again, I do recommend that you put in a password and make sure that you do that. And again, do not forget that in order to make sure that that is active, that you need to right-click on the command prompt and run as the administrator. And that's how you're going to do it here in Windows 10. Well, that does it for this tech tip. Having trouble with something of your own? Tweet me or find me on Facebook for help. Might even make a video about it. Also, be sure to subscribe for more tech tips and other tech content in the future. See you next time.